Hello, I'm Bernard Red72, and today I'm reviewing Ace Dragon D5 D72TH08. This is a burst Beyblade from the Hypersphere line. So, and yes, I know the package is damaged. I already busted it open slightly just so I could straighten out the launch cord. So, get it open. Comes with instructions and stuff. All that fun jazz that nobody really talks about. Uh, Uh, it comes with one, st one, sta oops. <laughs> one standard dual rotation launcher, a white launch cord, and this is just one. This is a straight one. It does not come straight. Uh, this is the Ace Dragon part. Ace Dragon. Uh, this is the... Uh, Forge disc. It is sting. Sting. And then we got. Then we got the driver. Let's get it zoomed in there. Yeah, there's the driver. This is an attack type. So, and uh, here's all the information. You can uh, interpret it because I'm not good at interpreting it. All right, let's put this sucker together. Got it. All right. The f I will admit the form factor is similar to Venom de Volos. Like, very, very similar. So. All right, let's give her, give uh, the two dragons. So, uh, let's get to it. I shall be using a Metal Flight Stadium because the first stadium I have is Doo Doo. Alright, so uh, let's give them a whirl. Ace Dragon barely wins, but this is two out of three, you know. So let's go to the restart. Come on, Dragon, get down there. Alright, this shall be the final battle, it's 1-1, one, one. it is currently Juan Juan, so, final battle, oh dear, oopsie, <laughs> Despite, despite the uh, really cheap garbage launchers falling apart, uh, Ace Dragon is uh, overall winner. Hooray. No burst finishes, which is not what I'm sad about, but that this is Ace Dragon. You guys probably want to know that I got mine for about 10 U.S. dollars, uh, including tax. So, if you want your own, <laughs> you get your own. Yeah. But I hope this review was helpful in, in making you make an educated purchase. But live, like, subscribe, Bernard Red Seventy Two. Bye, bye.